this one this one was really cool though it's titled concealing payloads in url credentials but oh, okay. essentially what this is is it's using the um the username and password parts of the url right so you've got http hps right. you username, know colon slash yeah, slash like and then username, username colon, colon, password. colon password app yeah exactly so that and um you know you can navigate to those urls in chrome and it just won't show anything in the url in the url bar but and it won't show anything in window location.href but it will show something in document.url so this hmm. is um this is another way that you can smuggle payload information into a page without like affecting the actual url of the page or putting anything in the hash or giving the waf anything to work with because it's it's client side um so it was it was surprising to to both Gareth and to me that location and document.url are different, and that you know definitely provides some ability to um, to play around with this. And he he pointed out really well that if that URL is actually being embedded into a an a tag or something like that, and that a tag has a, yeah. a an ID associated with it, then you can very easily access that value by using you know. ID with like DOM clobbering like functionality by using ID, in this case it was x, mm. dot username or dot password, and that will return that string that you smuggled in. <laughs>